have you ever been to the point where you're completely bored, where there's nothing else to do? You can't find something to watch on TV. There's nothing to read. You've reached the end of the internet. If you answered yes, I've got five ways Alexa can stop you from being bored. Plus, do you miss having Alexa while you're driving? Well, stick around to the end of the video. I've got a way to put Alexa in your automobile. Hi there, I'm Dave Nelson. Welcome to the channel where I show you how Alexa can help make your life better, more efficient, and of course, more fun. And on every video, I drink a different IPA, India Pale Ale. And on this one, I am consuming the Cowbell Brewing Company, Doc Purdue's Boxing Brewin. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so if you own or would like to own an Alexa enabled device, make sure that you subscribe to the channel and click that bell too, because that way you don't miss any of my videos. Alexa isn't all about organizing your life and getting things done. Amazon's virtual assistant can also keep you entertained. And on this video, I'm gonna show you five different ways to go about doing that, okay? If you're looking for a little mystery in your life, check out the CBS Radio Mystery Theater skill in your Alexa app. I used to listen to this show back in the day, actually on the radio. That just shows how old I am, but you can listen to it on your Alexa enabled device. So when you're ready to listen, just say, Alexa, open Radio Mystery Theater. Welcome to the Radio Mystery Theater podcast. Please say, Play the audio to start the podcast. Play the audio. And now here's act one of the old ones are hard to kill. It begins with a stethoscope, a blood pressure reading, Ooh. an electrocardiogram, and an altogether... I'm sure by now you've either personally experienced an escape room or at least heard about one, right? But you don't have to go anywhere to have a similar experience. It's as close as Alexa. First, you'll need to enable the escape the room skill in your Alexa app. When you're ready to start, say the following. Alexa, open escape the room. As this is your first time playing, let me help you get up to speed. Okay. Here's how it works. I will put you in a room and your job is to escape. Within the room you have three different actions you can take. You can look in a direction, inspect an object you see, or use an item you have on an object. If you can't come up with anything to do, just say the phrase that you told your parents when you were growing up. Alexa, I'm bored. Maybe this will cure your boredom. Some bird species, usually flightless birds, have only a lower eyelid, whereas pigeons use upper and lower lids to blink. If you want to do exactly what I just did, you have to make sure that you enable the Alexa I'm Bored skill in your Alexa app on your phone to get started. Alexa is known for many things, including controlling your smart home devices. But sometimes, you know, your assistant friend just wants to have fun. You can ask Alexa to play games like Jeopardy, Harry Potter Trivia, True or False, Song Quiz, and many, many more. In fact, Alexa has so many games, it'll keep you entertained for hours and hours and hours at a time. If you're isolated somewhere for 14 days, that's going to come in real handy. So let's play True or False, shall we? Here we go. Alexa, enable True or False. Okay, here's True or False. Welcome to True or False. I'll tell you facts about the world and you can say if you think they're true or false. How many people want to play? One. Great, one it is. On your marks. Here we go. True or false, the word, slang, is short for short language? True. Nice one. The earliest recorded use was in 1756. Here's another. True or false, in ancient Egypt, 
Servants were smeared with honey to attract flies away from the pharaoh. Hmm. Let me see. True. Nice work. King Pepe the second came up with the idea. King Pepe. Here's another. True or false, Snoop Dogg was a member of a gang before becoming famous. True. I'm impressed. If you're just sitting on the couch with no plans, nothing to do, you might as well get a workout in, right? The Amazon Alexa app offers tons of fitness skills, like guided workouts. And as promised at the beginning of the video, here's another Alexa-enabled device for you to check out. This time it's Echo. Echo Auto is not available in all countries, but if you're purchasing it through Amazon.com in the US, it's about $50. The Echo Auto adds Alexa to your car by connecting the Alexa app to your phone and plays through your car speaker via an aux input or through your smartphone's Bluetooth connection. The Echo Auto is designed for the road with eight microphones and can hear you over music, AC, and road noise. Using your voice, Echo Auto can stream audio from Audible, Amazon Music, Apple Music, Spotify, Sirius XM, and radio stations with TuneIn and iHeartRadio. Use your voice to play music, check the news, ask for directions, make calls, add to your to-do list, manage your calendar, and more. So if you really want Alexa in your car, $50 US really isn't a bad price. All right, thank you for watching another edition of Living with Alexa. If you liked what you saw, Make sure that you give the video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and make sure that that bell is clicked so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. I'm Dave Nelson, and until next time, Alexa, fade to black. Okay.